Hey there, marketing gurus and business owners. Ever wished for a crystal ball to predict the next big thing in your industry? What if I told you that you already have one at your fingertips and it's free? Meet Google Trends, a free tool that lets you peek into your customers' minds showing you what's trending, what's not, and what's about to be. Hello everyone, I'm Toby Danilchuk from 39 Celsius Web Marketing Consulting. And in the next few minutes, I'm going to show you how to turbocharge your marketing strategy using Google Trends. So buckle up, grab your coffee, and let's dive in. But before I do, if you find this video helpful, hit that like button, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more actionable and insightful tips on digital marketing. And if you want to improve your business's digital marketing presence with increased leads and sales and profit, reach out to me now at toby at 39celsius.com. Okay, back to the content. First off, let's talk about staying ahead of your competition. Let's say you own a med spa. You can use Google Trends to monitor the popularity of different aesthetic treatments. Here I did a search for chemical peels, but notice that microneedling is on the rise. Specifically, how much is microneedling? Time to capitalize on that trend and start promoting microneedling services. And you can do this by creating more content, digging in on more keywords around this topic, including it in email updates to your clients along with social posts. Next up, uncover new keywords. Imagine you run a vegan bakery. Google Trends might reveal a surge in searches for vegan cake mix. That's a fresh keyword to optimize your content around and maybe even launch a new product line. Lastly, let's touch on seasonal trends. Most businesses experience times of the year when demand is high and when demand is low. For example, if you're in the beauty industry, you might notice eyelash extensions peak during summer months, as in this Google Trends chart. You can use this insight to plan your marketing campaigns and manage your inventory as you approach that period of the year. You will also notice in this chart that interest in this topic post-COVID has not returned to where it once was. As a matter of fact, interest has dropped back to where it was eight years ago. So you can uncover great insights in Google Trends which can additionally be used to manage sales expectations. If we know interest is, is at its lowest point each year in the late fall, you can plan your marketing and promotional strategies accordingly. Plus, if you're getting other stakeholders that are telling you that something is wrong with your marketing, you can better manage those expectations. There's nothing wrong with marketing. We're in the seasonal lull that occurs each year about this time, so we need to plan our marketing and promotional tactics accordingly. But remember, while Google Trends is powerful, it's not perfect. Trends can change rapidly. It doesn't provide specific search volumes, and just because something's trending doesn't mean it will result in sales. So always use it alongside other market research tools. And there you have it. In just a few minutes, you've gained a powerful new free tool to supercharge your marketing strategy. So don't wait, start exploring Google Trends today. Let the insights guide you to marketing success. Don't forget to like and share and subscribe for more marketing tips and tricks. And if you want to up your marketing game and start driving more leads and sales, reach out to me directly now at toby at 39celsius.com. And until next time, I'll see you on the web.